Ole Miss on the road taking on Mississippi State. The Bulldogs beaten by the Rebels in game one of the rivalry sports director Joe Cook. He was in Starkville, saw MSU get some revenge on their rival. The Mississippi State Bulldogs coming into this game, coming off that bad loss to Florida. What better way to get back on track than getting a payback win over your rivals? And guess what? They were able to do that today at home right here at the hump. In front of a nice crowd at the Humphrey Coliseum, the Bulldogs and Rebels met for the second time this month. Both teams hungry for a win after losses. Ole Miss was feisty and pesky in the first half. Deshaun Ruffin with the team high six assists as he finds Nicer Brooks for an alley-oop. MSU tried to create space, but the Rebels were right there. They went on a 13-2 run, led 33-30 after Matthew Morrell three. He led the Rebels with 14. MSU closed the first half with a one-point lead after a strong take from Iverson Molinar. In the second half, the Bulldogs got the separation they needed thanks to an 8-0 run highlighted by DJ Jeffries and one. Ole Miss went cold over a five-minute stretch, and MSU took advantage. Garrison Brooks throws down two of his 17 points. Molinar led everyone with 20 as MSU went 78 to 60 to stay in the top half of the SEC. Here's Coach Hallen on the difference in today's game. We only gave up two points on fast breaks from them tonight. So that was huge. They only give up two points. And if you're able to get them to play or they have to try to score on you five on five versus in the open court, it's all a huge. That's something we emphasize every day. Uh, they just toned up a physicality in the second half that we couldn't match. And that's happened to us against Auburn, Tennessee, and Mississippi State. So Mississippi State splits the season series against the Rebels. Next up, they go to Kentucky for their next game. Reporting in Starkville at the Hump, Joe Cook, 16, WAPT Sports.